What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix the a JavaScript error occurred in the main process for Discord on Windows 10. This should be quite an easy tutorial, everything you need will be listed in the description below. First, make sure that Discord is not running on your system. The icon should not pop up in your system tray. Open up your task manager by right clicking your taskbar and selecting it. Here. Verify that there are no Discord processes still running in the background. After making sure that Discord is not running in the background, search for percentage app data percentage in your taskbar search. After hitting enter, a new folder will open up, where you will have to make sure to delete the Discord folder. Make sure that you are in the app data and roaming section of this folder. After deleting the Discord folder, Navigate back to App Data in your folder to get to the local section. Here, make sure to delete the second Discord folder. After deleting the two Discord folders, you will have to re-download the Discord installer, which will replace the deleted folders and will enable you to use Discord on your PC. Click on the link in the description to get to this page. Here, select to download the installer for Windows, and after a minute or two, the installer should be downloaded. In addition, make sure that you have admin permissions to reinstall Discord. After double-clicking the setup application, Discord will reinstall and should work without getting the JavaScript error. In case the issue persists, then make sure that your disk driver is up to date. In your taskbar search, enter Device Manager and hit Enter to open it up. Here, expand Disk Drives. Right click the drive on which Discord is installed, select Update Driver and then search automatically for updated driver software. This will take a minute to make sure that your driver is up to date. In case you are unsure about which disk drive to choose, then repeat this step for each one of them. You should also make sure that your antivirus is not blocking parts of the software, which can also cause the JavaScript error you are getting. I will leave a guide in the description below in case you need more information on how to fix this error. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.